Oh, y'all have to hear how Chad's first day of class went. Hot mess. I bite my tongue, it's a bad habit. I just woke up. It's 7.46. I had my alarm set for, I think, 8 o'clock or 8.30, but I woke up at like 7 o'clock. Today is the first day of classes. I'm kind of excited, not gonna lie. Um, only have one class. It started at 11, but I have no idea what I'm putting on. Like, when I tell you no idea, I mean no idea. I have this shirt that I like. This skirt, but it's wrinkled. Killed me. These pants. That's also kind of wrinkled. And this shirt that, like, so I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna wear. When I figure that out, I'm gonna come back there. I had to realize that on the catch I can be. Mm. Then we got the Lincoln Jerry deal. All right, the other phone on the charger so we have to stick with this low quality for now but i'm about to go downstairs to cafe latte and yeah but i just finished getting dressed probably get a coffee iced coffee um i'm probably starting to eat because i'm a little bit hungry so let's go First class starts at 11. I'm about to start getting ready for that. Um, I kind of don't even know what to expect or like what to prepare for, I guess. So I'm really just going in there with no expectations, really. Um, yeah, this coffee is good, but you know, I've had better. They didn't have any um, vanilla or caramel, but he still like finessed it and it's still like, you know, okay. Hell, catching track hawks. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna try to record and stuff as much as I can. I'm telling y'all, this new to me, just like it's probably new to y'all. It's super excited. I don't know why. I've never been this excited for class before. Probably because I'm in another country. Duh. But yeah, my class is from 11 to 12:40, which is a little on the long side for me personally because I'm used to like 50 minute classes or like an hour and 15 minute classes. <laughs> Chad just said, bruh, I can't wait to tell y'all about this class. <laughs> See, bro, this is why I'm excited, but like looking nervous, like for my class, because I don't know what to expect. You feel me? They always say expect the unexpected, but like, damn. <laughs> I'm not going to bring too much just for the simple fact that this is the first day. We shouldn't be doing too much. Probably go over the syllabus if they have one of those here. And probably just get acquainted with the professor and the students. I don't know, y'all. I'm just making an assumption. Just come on in. We're going to find out together. I just have this bullet journal that I'm going to bring. Which has my schedule in it. And we're going to bring a pencil and a paper. Like, why would the Vaseline fall like that? Trying to have mad tension right now. This is my show, not the Vaseline show, you feel me? Hey, look at the check. I'm really so excited. <laughs> and tell me why my dumbass only brought one mechanical pencil from home. And they don't have mechanical pencils here, so... I'm gonna have to figure that out. But, like, it's okay, you know? It's okay. That's right. Trying to steal the show, too. What time is it? It's 46. Let me get the fuck. Let me hurry up. If I be late on the first day and they be like, you feel me? I feel like, <laughs> I feel like I already got a lot to prove because I'm an American. You feel me? So, let me not be late. Even though, let me tell y'all something. Kenyans, they will tell you 7 o'clock. That really means 7.30. In America, we call that CP time. That's how they operate on CP time. But just because they operate on CP time, 
that don't mean I'm gonna show up late. I'm gonna show up on time and then we gonna go from there. I think I look cute or not? Be honest. I need something for my lips. We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Coming through the sky. What do you want to stand? Um, come up, poor. Get ready. Hey, now let's go. <laughs> I know I keep telling y'all I'm excited, but like, y'all see that I'm excited? Clearly. Clearly, y'all can see that I'm excited. Also, my roommate didn't come yet. I'm not really sure how I feel about that. Because ever since being in college, like, I never had a roommate. Like, I always had my own room. So, having a roommate is going to be a whole new experience within itself. But she didn't get her yet, so... And I'm not even going to get my hopes up on having my own room because her stuff is there. But I kind of want a roommate just for the experience. But then I'm nervous. You feel me? I get what I'm saying? I just had my elbow on the freaking table and that it wasn't funny, bro. Like, at all. I'm kind of pissed, actually. That's the bathroom. That shit right by my door. Convenient for me. Inconvenient. When I gotta hear everybody else in the bathroom. I was just excited, but I'm feeling a little bit nervous. Ain't like gonna lie, I'm a little bit nervous, y'all. But I don't really have much to say, so I'm not even about to waste y'all time as well as mine. So I'm gonna just see y'all when I get to class, okay? Something I just realized, I got on my blue Crocs, right? And that went with the fit when I had on the Lincoln Windbreaker. Mm -hmm. But now I just look out on an orange ass shirt with blue sneakers, well, blue Crocs. And that wasn't the case, you feel me? It's probably, it's low key probably best if I flip the camera and the other one record. But like, I gotta get used to vlogging and everybody just watching me because that's something I ain't really, that's something I ain't really too comfortable with. This is probably a challenge that you're gonna have to face. Just the way they operate is different. The classroom, the shit not open, there's nobody here. I told y'all, Kenyan, Kenyans run on CP time. And like, <laughs> yeah. We have um, IDs and our fingerprints on at the classroom, but like they have to be, I don't even know how to explain it to you because this is already some futuristic shit. So, but they have to be like pre, I don't know, pre unlocked. I'm not really sure. But usually it works if the classrooms aren't, I guess, actually locked. Thank you. I left class. And another thing I didn't know, even to leave out the class, you have to swipe your ID. Futuristic. Okay, so I'm gonna put the gang goes. Y'all know the original crew. <laughs> I told y'all already finished class, but y'all, y'all have to hear how Chad's first day of class went. Hot mess. Um, we'll be transferring out. We'll be going to another class. Um, y'all know the weird teachers that we have in America? Yes, giving that. He was an hour late. Class started at 9 a.m. Why did he not get there until 10 a.m.? <laughs> and then did not let us out until 12.32 a.m. P.m., sorry. It was a hot mess. It was just, I don't like it. He was like, we're going to have to make class presentations. Mind you, I thought this was a neo-elective. Why am I making presentations in the elective? That sounds like, what work? Why do <laughs> And then you got to tell him about when you told him you were to stay. Oh, yeah. I was like, okay, so he wanted us to do class introductions, which took a whole hour from 10 when he got there to 11. <laughs> Name, major, year. Where you from? I said, okay, my name is Chad. I'm a senior. I'm a foreign exchange student from the States. <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> Why are people laughing? <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> what is so funny? <laughs> I don't understand. Because I would have been like, what's the joke? <laughs> right. <laughs> you feel me? But you can't be that way. Mm -mm. You have a lot of self-control. Like, 
I'm really mm -hmm. proud of you for that. No. Because I would have been like, I'm from the States and what? There wasn't shit funny about me being from the <laughs> States. Like, and y'all, I'm not, I, it's like. And then they kept talking about the States, so I don't understand what's funny. <laughs> You want to laugh at this face? <laughs> that was probably shady. I should probably take that out. <laughs> take that out the vlog. But then, y'all, let me tell y'all, when I was walking from class, I'm going to come here, like, just be prepared for everybody to be staring at you. Like, you are, like, a dog on display. That's kind of how I feel. Like, I'm on display, and yeah. But Brenica didn't go to her class yet. Not yet. What time your class start? 20 minutes. Hey y'all. We can walk her to class. Yeah, we definitely can. Walk to class. <laughs> okay, cool. And hey, y'all, hopefully, I, I'm trying to get some lunch. Why didn't tell me when I got out of class it wasn't lunch time yet? It was noon. <laughs> y'all, it was damn near 12:30, and they tried to tell me it wasn't lunch time. Also, when you come to Kenya, be prepared to wake up early. Life starts around 7 a.m. And I have realized that every single day, no because you hear the birds start, it, it Yo, hits you at once. It's like, Yo, once 7 a.m. hits, everything hits. Mm -hmm. Cars, people be cranking up their cars, <laughs> birds be loud, everything. People were loud last night, though. Yo, they, they, were, really they were loud. <laughs> it sounded like thousands of people were outside. I cannot, one thing I can't stand about living with people is when they drag their feet in the <laughs> 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 keeps saying feet, that, bro. Especially when you got slides on. Oh my God. Oh my God. Chop the feet off, okay? Wait, where's your class? Yeah. This way. And I told you I only had one class today, so I'm finished. After I eat, don't tell nobody about my taking that. <laughs> <laughs> I my believe. Come in. <laughs> <laughs> For real, <laughs> this third my goddamn piece, y'all. I was thinking, I'm like, damn, if I go to sleep right now, what if I come back and then she just busts in the door? I always think she's gonna walk in when I'm like ass naked, chained oh, or something. That's awesome. Just showing y'all some of the signs, buddy. Even I showed y'all before, but I'll just show y'all again. Oh, and I got a saw sticker that's been sticking around for a few days. <laughs> Oh, it's making me think maybe I should see the nurse. <laughs> I think these the ones with the mirrors. I feel like all of them got mirrors when you open these doors. Oh, look at you talking shit. <laughs> Yo, this is what I got on. Y'all see my Lincoln? Got my Lincoln gear. What floor? Third, I think. I got my Lincoln shirt on. You feel me? I got it. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. And my Lincoln Crocs, kinda. Ooh, we got two more visitors. I had stopped recording in the elevator because we had two special guests. Angie. Is that Angie? Is yeah. that Angie? <laughs> hey, I'm just vlogging. Hi. So Hi, Angie. She was extremely helpful. Y'all already know y'all seen her before. Helpful, too. <laughs> so. Now she's helping me because I missed out on like, the information about school opens. Oh. So I just got back to my room. My nipples are a little bit hard because I'm kind of cold. I don't know if y'all can tell. But I just ate. You feel me? It was like this chicken and I kind of got a little bit to go. It was this chicken and this rice. I should have filmed it, but I ended up waiting like over an hour for my food, you know? So that kind of threw me off. And I was also on the phone with my dad, so yeah. But remember I told y'all about the iced coffee that I usually get every morning? Miriam, she's a chef here. She told me about um this espresso, whatever the hell this is. This is the new drink. It tastes like a vanilla iced coffee and a vanilla iced coffee and a chocolate milkshake like they had a kid. Oh, my stomach feels like it's about to bust. I was supposed to go to the... Fuck. I was supposed to... <laughs> Yo, I gotta lay down. I was supposed to go to the gym with Chad and um Brenica at four right but i told y'all the food it just you know it just kind of set me back some so we probably gonna end up going at 4 30 but like 
I need to lay down. And at least just close my eyes for a minute. Keep it a bean. Keep it a bean. Because my stomach, it don't look like it. I just realized that. Man, I don't care what y'all say. My stomach full, you feel me? Shit on her. And I ate to the maximum capacity. And it was good. I give it a... 7 out of 10. Only because in it, it had like a cilantro. And if you ever had cilantro, cilantro has like a strong taste to it. So maybe I should say 8 out of 10. No, I'm sticking with 7 out of 10. If it didn't have the cilantro, probably an 8 out of 10. But the cilantro made it a um, 7 out of 10 because it was just so like overpowering in some bites. But yeah. Can y'all see this? This is for my mosquito, but y'all probably can't see. Come back after I take a nap. Because Kenya been kicking on me. <sighs> yeah. That's how my stomach feel right now. They're working out. I'm not going to work out. I think I'm going to edit. I probably said that previously, but I'm saying it again. But look at these gym rats. Proud of them. Day one. <laughs> Drop your stuff, chat. <laughs> That's what a view they get while working out. Huh. <laughs> and so I just got back to my room. Mm -hmm. I really don't remember the last time I picked up the camera. It's only like six something, but like my day is pretty much over. And I also realized, ooh, it is Vaseline, Vaseline out here. I also realized I don't ever really close out my videos. But make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. I be forgetting to tell y'all to do that, even though that's something that should be automatic. I'm gonna remind y'all anyway. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow, gang girls. Yeah. Same. <laughs>